Welcome, everybody, to another presentation of the NBA Live on 2K Sports. In this game, we'll see Albuquerque against Miami with Hall of Famer Doris Burke and Greg Anthony. This is Kevin Harlan. On the sidelines, we have David Aldridge reporting. Now, here's Gilgis Alexander. And they're running. And it's Dikembe with the jam. Oh, nice work by Matumbo in transition. Terrific at getting to the right spot in order to execute. What's up a three? Shots good by Rice. And they don't want to get in a habit of giving him open looks from three. First quarter still, but not who you want to leave open. Here's Wembenyama for three. That falls. Nice speed that time from Dwayne Wade. And, and when Wembenyama's making that, I just don't know how you guard. And that one goes out of bounds. Last touch by Gilgis Alexander. And here's Wembenyama. He'll bring it up for Miami. to Rice. Back to Wembenyama. A three ball. Rebound by Albuquerque. A little over a minute gone here in the first quarter. From the wing. Here's Rice. Puts up a deep three. Wembenyama with the rebound. Rare you'll see him miss such an open look. Hands it from downtown. And nice mechanics from Miller there. Ready to fire as that pass is coming. Here's Gilgis Alexander. Launches it. And again, Miami with the triple. Good way to start this game. You want to get him rolling as early as possible. He's a guy who, if he gets hot, he can carry your offense for long stretches. Nice work to get it inside and draw the contact. And a look now at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for Miami. They're controlling the pace of this game, pushing the ball up court and getting good looks in early offense. And they've also done a really good job taking advantage of miscues. Their defense has been stifling in this one. And Benyama outside. Shoots the three. Drains it from beyond the arc. Wembenyama has got nine points. And when Wembenyama is connecting from deep, he is downright unguardable. This is how special a talent he is. Here's Rice. Knocked away. Three-pointer. Offensive rebound. Back to Wembenyama. Tries it again. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle, and now a three-point play chance here for him. And this kid is tough. Wembenyama just powering it in despite the contact. First quarter of play, we're about three minutes in. Here's Rice. Pass to Gilgis Alexander. Shot clock at six. Albuquerque needs to get a shot off. Good on the three-point shot. Six points for him. And look at how Rice is just totally ready for the moment. Just put the ball in his hands, and he's good to go. And that's out of bounds. Miami will retain possession. Greg, isn't it amazing the way Gilgis Alexander has polished off his game? The footwork, Kevin, is impeccable. Three-level score makes every shot imaginable. And what's scary, this guy still has another level to get to. Here's Price. And he drives in. Yeah, we're seeing some fireworks from them already. Well, what I love is the game plan has been solid from the opening tip. And guys are making their shots. That's critical. 
And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Wen Benyama. Active hands from him as he's able to deflect that pass out of bounds. Well, that's what you call a game of inches. They talk about it in football. We'll see it right there. And the shot goes down. Well, pretty pass from Shea Gilgis Alexander. This guy can score it, but make sure you're lifting up the guys around you. Yeah, that's a tough call right there, and really a tough break for the deep. That's his second personal foul. Here's Rice. He has six. Rem Benyama, a screen. And again, Albuquerque with the triple. And that's why Rice is in the discussion of the great three-point shooters of all time. Terrific touch from D. That man can fill it up. Sinks the three-pointer. Three and so many teams now look to establish the perimeter to set up everything else. No doubt it's a growing trend, Greg, and he is highly accurate tonight. Albuquerque shooting their third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. What's been amazing to watch is Shea Gilgis Alexander going from good player to now putting his name at the very top of the list in terms of great guards in the league. Here's Wembenyama. 15 points in the game. Pass to Rice. Takes the three. No basket with that shot. Having trouble finding his range. He's one for five. Here's Rice. Covered by Miller. Heads it off. And the last shot before the buzzer is off. The scoring fast and furious as we end the first quarter. Miami leads by seven. After this break, we'll be back with the... 22. And hope you've enjoyed the broadcast so far. Halfway through the first half in this one. And let's quickly break down the game we've seen from Miami, guys. Just stretching out the floor in that first. Uh, they had the defense... Scrambling. And that was obviously the plan coming in. Now the big question, can they maintain that efficiency from range as the game goes along? Lynn Rice. That's his second personal foul. First team foul. Brown outside. It's stolen by Dang. You know, anticipation is a huge part of defense, and he played it perfectly right there. To Gilgis Alexander. Shoots. Gilmore grabs the miss. Well, that's a blown defensive coverage, but it doesn't matter. He cannot answer the bell. Not quite enough defense that time around. Just lucky he was off. And there's the eight second call as they can't get it across half court in time. Over to the left wing. A three from Ren Benyama. And a great assist by Gildas Alexander as that one goes in. Zero hesitation from Wimby. Coming into the lead, just trusting his jump shot. Gildas Alexander can't get it to go. That's a shot he makes with regularity, but that time the defense up to the challenge. Dang. And that one is hammered home. Kevin, not a Petty, not a Manny, but a face. Oh, bounce to the ounce, Greg, yeah, showing off the money. And Dr. J slams it in. <laughs> One of the best dunkers in the league off the drive. I mean, he's often still hanging in the air, but other guys are on their way down. Nailed from three-point land. Rice has got 12. This guy, a tough cover for any defender. Creative and assertive, scoring the ball. Stoudemire wide open. Drills the three-pointer. And Miami leads by four. And this is the range Stoudemire has. I like seeing him test his limit. Good on the triple. And an eye for an eye. Both teams working to stretch the floor. Well, that three-point shot just gives you so much room to operate on the offensive end. 
to Gilgis Alexander. And again, Miami with the triple. Boy, the young fella knocking down the three to answer on the other end. Wow, go ahead, Gilgis Alexander. Oh, and when Benyama throws it down. How good a playmaker are we watching? Always leading, always trying to create for others. You know, here we are, Greg, looking at Victor Wembanyama. I mean, <laughs> can he get any taller? Wow. <laughs> well, he's already seven foot four, Kevin. But he is. What's amazing is that I still think he's grown, which is scary for the rest of the league. And it's slammed in by Jones. Showtime. Eddie Jones has incredible hops. Irving attacking. Beyond the arc. And again, Miami with the triple. Wow, you don't see him left alone very often. And of course, he makes good use of it. Our test up top. Plenty of space. It's good. He makes his first shot of the game. Well, nine times out of ten, that probably is a miss, but somehow he finds a way. Pass to Stoudemire. Irving with a clean look. And again, Miami with the triple. Such a reliable threat from range. You'd think the defense might key on him a little bit more. That bucket in in no time at all. Jones has got five points now this quarter. And Jones is known to be a deadly three-point shooter. A beautiful shooting motion there on those triples. Fifty-eight seconds left for the first half of basketball. Six on the shot clock. Here's Gilmore. Rebound by Albuquerque. You know, the right thing there to try to fade away with the D all over him, but that is a difficult shot to sink. Picked by Elijah on. We've got 33 seconds left to play here in the half. Our test up top. For three. And again, Albuquerque with the triple. And he's not going to miss those very often, even from deep. But he has to close out a little stronger on him. And it's Ron Artest with the foul. That is his first foul of the game. His first personal foul. Second team foul. 19 seconds left now here on the second. Now, Gilgis Alexander. Pass to Gilmore. Lock at six. Irving for three. And the last shot at the buzzer doesn't go in for it. And that'll do it for the first half. A competitive game so far. Albuquerque out in front. They lead by two. Step away briefly, but get you right back out here for the start of the third quarter after our halftime. And after a fairly even first couple of quarters, the second half could turn out to be a great one as both teams try to gain an edge. Eddie Jones on the wing. And it's Elijah on top of the key. Over Ren Benyama. It's to Elijah on. Here's our test. Ren Benyama with the rebound. Here's Matumbo. It's good, and it's Ren Benyama with the assist. Matumbo's got the game tied up here for Miami. And Okafor has it in the corner. And again, it's Albuquerque. I tell you what, he came out of that locker room raring to go. Rembenyama looking it over. Rice traps in the tray. Rice has got five. Oh, how about the vision by Wimbenyama there? Always looking to get teammates involved. Elijah on outside. Miller grabs the miss. And here's Miller. He'll bring it up for Miami. They've held a 12-point lead early. Sinks the triple. And now a four-point Miami lead. 
And I like when Wimbenyama is aggressive on offense because defenses feel helpless to stop him. Just over a minute and a half played here in the third. Pass to Okafor. Back to our test. Picked by Okafor. Just five on the clock. Launches it from deep. Miller grabs the miss. Well, he tries to enter with a three of his own and can't do it. You can't get caught up in the one-on-one -on -one aspect. Pass to Rice. The tray. And the three ball is good. Rice has got six here in this quarter. And not just the score, but the condition as well, showing great vision on that play. Now, I'll bet even they didn't think the pick would work that well. No, no, no. And they get the major league dunk out of it, too. And my question is, where was the help? Someone rotate over and challenge. Their ability, again, to stretch the floor, particularly in this second half. And guys, boy, when you're hitting, it sure does work. It obviously opens up major options at the offensive end. And it's Miami's ball. They're on a 14-6 run. And Benyama with it. 18 points for him. Over Okafor. And it's Miami with another. They had a monster game for Wimby with the matchup issues he creates. I'm not sure anyone in this league can stop him. And he's on. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. You know, we see this all the time. You're basically, as a defender, hoping the man misses rather than putting in the work to get over screens. Jones with it. Wade picks him up. Yep, that one goes. Now just a three-point Miami lead. And, and since halftime, this has become an intense ball game. They are getting after it hard. It has become a real battle out there. Now a timeout called by Miami. Let's give a big round of applause. You are dancing. Let's give him a big round of applause. You're dancing. 116 left to play here in the third. Yeah, but I mean, maybe could have tried for a more memorable dunk than that one. And we know he's capable of those memorable ones. Back to Jones. And again, it's Albuquerque. They seem to concede that shot, and his response is, thank you very much. Miami leading by three. Irving from long range. Okafor grabs the miss. Outside our test. Julius Irving. That's his first personal foul. Second team. Miami on defense. Down low. Elijah Wan. And then Elijah Wan with the dunk. I mean, I hope you can appreciate the torque that that kind of move generates. He just has that natural explosiveness. The dream is something to behold. Thirty-two seconds left in the third. Great, their offensive approach has been rock solid here, and they're finding the weak spots in the D and attacking it. Third quarter here, and five lead changes so far. And guys, neither team has been able to pull away. And Gilgis Alexander gets it to go. It's very long, and SGA so effective around the hoop because of that length. And here's Jones. He's got 11. Butler on the way. Jacks up a three. The shot, no good. Pressured that shot by getting a hand up just as good as a block. And he did it without fouling, and that's become an art. Changing shots without making contact. The away team. 
with Dina. Okay, man. And with three quarters behind us, we start the fourth quarter, what is still anybody's ballgame. Albuquerque trails by four. Pass to our test. From downtown, the rebound by Victor Rembenyama. Drives to the hoop. And Rembenyama throws it down. So fluid off the bounce to Rembenyama. Over in the corner, Elijah. And now Miller running the floor all by himself. Here's Wembenyama for three. Rebound by Albuquerque. Right side Jones. Fires for three. Six to shoot. Here's Elijah on. You love how Esau has risen to the challenge throughout this one. I'll tell you, we have seen great execution from both teams. Neither one giving an inch here. Controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. And, and those second chance points really become almost like bonus points when you can get them. On the basket by Jones. The defenders need to recognize the importance of staying on him as we get into crunch time. And there's the call on Jones. It'll be his second foul of the game. That's his second personal foul. First team foul. About a minute and a half into the fourth quarter now. And Gilgis Alexander's got the ball here for Albuquerque. They trail by three. An aggressive move and fantastic finish. Mm, trying to send a message with that slam, I think. The drive by Wembenyama. That's down the hatch. Knocks one more to his total. That's nine for 15 shooting. And this is what you want to see. Mumbanyama attacking with authority inside. Miami leading by three. Now a timeout called by Miami. the latest now from our sideline reporter David Aldridge. David, it's all yours. Take it away. Hey, Kevin. During the last break, I heard Doc Rivers talking with his team. Now, with this game up for grabs, coach told his guys to think positive. He said, we know this game is ours, fellas. We've earned it. I need you to show me right now that you want this. When they get it done, we'll see. Guys? Thank you, David. Oh, Victor Wimbanyama. A thunderous finish there. Here's Rice. They get the rebound. On the wing, Gilgis Alexander. It's good, and it's Rembenyama with the assist. That's one of those clutch shots he's known for. When the pressure is high, he seems to be the most locked in. Rembenyama outside. Master Rice. Shot clock at five. Miami needs to get a shot off. The jumbo misses. One-on-one -on -one here. Outside, Gilgis Alexander. Outside down. Here's Rice. Pass to Wembenyama. Here's Rice to tie it up. Here's Gilmore. No luck that time in the shot that would have put them on top. Knocks it loose. Outside, Gilgis Alexander. And the dunk by Gilgis Alexander. There is no moment too big, no pressure too heavy for Mr. Shea Gilgis Alexander. The delivery is on time. Here's Rice. Carries it from three-point range. Rice has got 11 points here in just the second half. And you have to trust a consistent score like Rice in these situations. This guy not afraid of the moment. Rembenyama, a screen. Rice, no good. 
You will not see this guy miss many of those. He's one of the keys to their floor spacing. And Ben Yama outside. Down to five on the shot clock. Good ball movement here by Miami. The shot. It drops. Late in the game, up big, they continue to attack. And as a result, they may be facing just a little bit less resistance right now. They are having their way. And now they decide to foul attention. Dikembe Mutombo, his third personal foul. First team foul. 11 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Outside, Gilgis Alexander. Mutombo really is an amazing defender. He just takes pride in contesting every shot. How do you like that? I mean, the rookie stepping up big time. He had to foul, and on that occasion, to stop the clock. That's the enemy in this situation. Now a timeout called by Miami. They're ahead by three. Just two seconds left to play here in the fourth. For the away team. And that's an intentional foul. Austin Reeves. Home team foul. So the first one drops, and that gives them a four-point cushion. That's his first personal foul. So he goes two for two at the one, and it's a five-point game. Clutch, clutch free throws there. That should ensure they're going home with the W. And so it's Miami winning this one. A truly gutsy...